OpenAI has just signed a deal with Mattel in order to let Mattel utilize their AI models in Mattel's own products. Now, this raises a lot of questions in a lot of different areas. For example, children's data privacy. Mattel makes toys for like ages 1 to 12, and you know, there's a lot of data privacy laws out there in regards to handling children's data privacy and how much data companies can collect on young children, if at all, under certain circumstances. And AI kind of toes the line a little bit because AI um, does kind of feed in on itself. When you give AI data, it will use some of that data to train itself and improve itself. And because of the data privacy laws regarding children, obviously you can understand how there can be some issues there. And not only that, but one other issue I think I have with this is the fact that if you're going to start putting AI in toys, I feel like that could cause weird developmental issues, sort of. I'm not, I'm not saying like, um, like serious, serious problems, but I more so mean like, if, if you're giving a child a toy that acts like a certain character or something and can speak, like, um, and interact like that character, I have to wonder how you can do that distinguishing between, like, fiction and reality. I feel like with young children, it could be a little iffy. Then again, I'm no psychologist, and I don't think there's any studies that have been done on this and what would happen. This is all fairly new territory, all things considered. AI has only just started getting good, like, five-ish years ago. This is very uncharted. If you want to learn more, you can watch my full video link down below or I cover